Okay. <clears throat> Next question. Have, it's like you're reading my paper here. Okay. Uh, have there been any studies done on how this development will affect services like police and fire departments and school enrollment and expenses, et cetera? Or even how further commercial development will affect businesses that already exist in Bethel? In other words, Greenwood Avenue versus maybe the area past CVS? I don't think so. Um, the, Have there the, been any studies done? That was the question. No, the, not to the best of my knowledge, no. I, offhand, I don't know if the plan of conservation and development includes impacts like, um, you know, like uh, we're going to need more police officers or more fire trucks. I, I don't think so, but I, I, I can't answer the question offhand. In terms of impact on other businesses, no. You're, you're talking about um, very probably a pretty expensive study that would have to be commissioned. The last time I came across something, um, going through a file here in this office, I came across a, I think it was a 1962 study that had been commissioned, I think, by the Economic Development Group at that time. And it projected total growth in the town of Bethel. And it's kind of interesting because that study, I, I gave it to the superintendent a few months ago because it had a lot of information about schools. But it projected that the, that the, that the town of Bethel's population would top out at about 22,000. Uh, and then there wouldn't really be any more room to grow after that. And that's an interesting number because we're approaching 20,000 right now. And there's, I don't think it's actually going to go to 22,000 because there's, there's only a couple of places where you could put any kind of high-density housing. And, Really, the planning department is discouraging high-density housing. They're going more for single-family if you have them. But there, you know, there's a little bit of development here and there, but I, I don't see it going that high. That's, that's a personal guess on my part. But to your question, no, that the town has not spent money commissioning any, uh, any kind of studies like that, just the POCD. Okay. 